Alright. Just almost hit a couple coming around in one corner. But luckily I'm going slow enough that one only like 10 miles an hour. And I happen to look up and the sun's in my face. And just happen to see the guy out of the corner corner of my eye coming around the corner. And I just swerved out of the way. He waved and his girlfriend was putting on her jacket. Hey, I want to know know something. It's just funny. Uh, a lot more of us could could be not paying uh, property taxes. You want to know how that is? How we could not be paying property taxes is the fact that. When a family member back in the old days, uh, you, you would bury them on your property. And nowadays we put them in cemeteries because government wants you to put them in cemeteries. Uh oh, somebody's at our spot, Rocky. Uh oh. Uh oh, so we can't go there, so we gotta go somewhere else. Somebody's in our spot. Probably that, probably that hunter down there. Maybe he's down in his tree stand. Uh, so anyway, yeah, I, 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 this was going across TikTok, but it makes sense. It makes sense, and uh, why the government wants you to put your loved one in a cemetery verses on your property because if you put your put your uh, family member on your property you don't have to pay property tax so uh, since my, does my dog count with that like I, I just had like uh, I just had a dog died so if I take his ashes and bury him in the backyard does that count as a cemetery? Uh, pet cemetery. Does that count? Can anybody tell me out there? Mark it in the comment. Uh, if, if that's even a thing, or can I even do that with my pet? So I don't have to pay property tax anymore. And how do I go about informing them that there that that I did bury my, for a pet cemetery on, on, just on my little whatever, half acre plot. Uh, do you have to, what kind of forms do you have to send in? Because that would really help this year coming up, 2025, because they've already raised FEMA rates. Uh, it went from 1300 uh, dollars to 1500 for 2024 now it's going to be 1700 for uh, 2025 so at this rate I'm going to be kicked out of my house because I can't afford to pay mortgage I won't be able to pay the mortgage because I have to pay FEMA the flood fee that's $1700 just in a year, and then whatever taxes they're going to impose, as soon as, oh, well, might as well say Kamala's going to get in. I, I hope the hell not, though, but if she gets in, there's going to be taxes on everything. Everything. Every stinking thing there's going to be taxes put on, and you think they'd have to put that through Congress, you know, but... I, I don't understand it how we have to pay the, pay these prices if it's not put through Congress. But anyway, yeah, I would like to know that if I put a uh, uh, put bury start burying pets on the property, is that considered a cemetery? So 
Uh, it doesn't have to be, you know, like a family member or somebody like that. I'm just saying pets or animals, if you make it a, a, a cemetery, uh, w w would I have to pay property tax? That's what I want to know. Put it in the comments, people. Put it in the comments. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.